Hello, you're welcome to solve this math problem, which is 24x cubed minus 8x squared is equal to 1. To find the values of x from this equation. So first, we should note that x is not equal to 0. Because if x is 0, it will not satisfy this equation. Then, from here, we first let x is equal to 1 over t so it will be 24 then x power 3 we substitute this 1 over 3 so it will be 1 over t power 3 then minus 8 x square it will be 8 times x square it will we substitute this it will be 1 over t square then is equal to this 1 then in next step to remove this denominator, these fractions in the denominator, we'll multiply the whole equation times this t power 3. And also, we should note that t power 3 is not equal to 0. Because if it is equal to 0, it will not satisfy this our equation. Then, we we'll take this times t power 3, this and this will cancel, so it will be 24 then minus 8 times 1 over t squared times t power 3 this and this will cancel so it will be t t times 8 is 8 t is equal to 1 times t power 3 it is t power 3 then we take this negative 8 t into the right side and this 24 into the right side so it will be this t power 3 then this one we take to this side to be plus 8t and this one we take to this side it will be minus 24 is equal to 0. Then in next step to solve this cubic equation from the factors of 24 is starting with 1. So when we substitute here 1 it will not be equal to 0 but when we substitute 2 in here it will be 2 power 3 2 power 3 is 8 then plus 8 2 times 8 is 16 then minus this 24 is equal to 0 so the factors of 24 for 2 it will be t is equal to 2 it will give a valid solution then we solve this by getting this t is equal to 2, we solve by synthetic division. So we we'll write here 2. Then coefficient of t power of 3 is 1. Coefficient of t square, there is no t square, so it will be 0. Coefficient of t is 8. And constant is negative 24. Then it will be equal to, in here we'll drop this 1 here then 2 times 1 it is 2 0 plus 2 is 2 2 times 2 is 4 8 plus 4 is 12 2 times 12 is 24 negative 24 plus 24 is 0 now the remainder is 0 so this quadratic equation coefficient of t square is 1 then plus coefficient of t, it will be 2t, then plus constant is 12. So this quadratic equation times the linear equation, which is this t is equal to 2, when we take 2 into the left side, it will be t minus 2, is this linear times this quadratic is equal to this 0. Now from here we have two solutions. This first solution t minus 2 is equal to 0. So in here this first solution is t is equal to 2. And second solution is this t square plus 2t plus 12 is equal to 0. Then from here to find the value of t we will we'll use quadratic formula which is t is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a 
then it will be t is equal to negative b here it is 2 plus or minus square root of b square to b2 square which is 4 then minus 4 times a a is 1 times c c is 12 then over 2 times a a is 1 so it will be t is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of let's start to multiply this negative 4 times 1 times 12 it will be negative 20 28 so it will be 4 minus 28 then over this time this is 2 so it will be t is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of this minus this is negative 44 then over 2 so it will be equal to t is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of negative 24 is same as 4 times 11 times negative 1 then over this 2 then it will be t is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of 4 is 2 times this square root of 11 then times square root of negative 1 it is i then we divide by 2 in both parts so it will be it will be t t is equal to negative 2 divided by 2 is negative 1 plus or minus 2 and 2 will cancel so here it will be square root of 11 i now in here we already get the second value of t whereas the first value of t is equal to this we already get the first value of t is equal to 2 which is this one now the next step we recall before we let t is equal to in here before we let x is equal to 1 over t so from x x x is equal to 1 over t then t it will be equal to 1 over x is reciprocal so then we compare these two solutions so it will be 1 over x is equal to 2 then we cross multiply it will be x times 2 is 2x is equal to 1 then we divide by 2 in both sides this and this will cancel then it will be x is equal to 1 over 2 so this is the first value of x in this uh, problem and also in this second solution from t is equal to 1 over x then we compare these two solutions so it will be 1 over x is equal to this negative 1 plus or minus square root of 11 i now in here we have two solutions because of plus or minus for the first solution when it is positive it will be 1 over x is equal to negative 1 then plus square root of 11 i then to the value of x will be equal to reciprocal of this it will be 1 over this negative 1 plus square root of 11 i then we rationalize the denominator so we'll multiply by this it will be negative bracket negative 1 this positive to be minus square root of 11 i bracket then bracket negative 1 minus square root of 11 i bracket then the next step it will be x is equal to this times this it will be negative 1 minus square root of 11 i then over negative 1 times negative 1 it is positive 1 negative 1 times negative square root of 11 i it will be negative square root of 11 i square root of 11 i times 
this negative 1 times negative square root of 11i, it is positive square root of 11i. Positive square root of 11i times negative 1, it will be minus square root of 11i. Then square root of 11i times negative square root of 11i, it will be negative. Then square root of 11 times square root of 11, it will be 11. Then times i times i is i square. i square is same as negative 1. Then it will be x is equal to this negative 1 minus square root of 11i over this and this will cancel. Negative 11 times, times negative 1 is 11. 11 plus 1 it is 12. So it will be x is equal to this divided by this it will be negative 1 over 12. Negative 11 square root of 11i over 12. So it will be minus square root of 11i over 12. So this is the value of x for the first case when it is positive. And the other case when it is negative, whereas it will be 1 over x is equal to when it is negative to be 1 minus square root of 11i. So negative 1 minus square root of 11i. Then in here, the value of x will be equal to reciprocal of this 1 over negative 1 minus square root of 11i. Then we shall rationalize to be negative 1 plus square root of 11i in the num denominator and in the numerator. So it will be x is equal to this and this it will be negative 1 plus square root of 11i over this times this is 1 this times this is minus square root of 11i this times this it will be positive square root of 11i this times this it will be minus square root of 11 times square root of 11 is 11 i times i is i square whereas i square is same as negative 1 then it will be x is equal to this negative 1 plus square root of 11i then over this and this will cancel negative 11 times negative 1 is positive 11 positive 11 plus 1 it is 12 so to be x is equal to this over this negative 1 over 12 this over this it will be plus square root of 11i over 12 Therefore, this is the value of x. The other value of x in this are problem. So we have this value of x, we have this value of x, and this value of x. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video.